following footage shows refurbishment of insulation on a chiller system. The pipes are located in an outdoor area that is protected by a roof. However, the enclosure is open at the sides and pipes are exposed to some weather and sunlight. The existing insulation had been applied over 10 years ago, but not correctly fitted in all areas and badly needed replacing to rectify the faults. The refurbishment work involves insulating the pipes with Armaflex insulation in 32 millimeter thickness. The insulated pipes will be protected from weather and sunlight with the Armachex silver cladding system. The following video shows how Armaflex is easily cut and formed to make a T-section and how this can be covered with Armachex silver cladding. The base of the T is created from a section of Armaflex pipe insulation selected to fit the pipe diameter. The circumference of the adjoining pipe is marked on the top of the Armaflex tube and then cut out. The remainder of the T is prepared from Armaflex sheet. The sheet is first cut to fit the circumference of the pipe. On the Armaflex tube, the lowest point of the sheet's join is identified from the sheet thickness, and this used to measure the vertical distance to the tube's upper edge. The Armaflex sheet is then divided into four equal sections and marked to show the upper and lower points where it will join the tube. Using the difference between these joins as a radius, arcs are then marked at the intersections of the lines. Using chalk, the arcs can be used to create a continuous line. The sheet is then cut along the line using a sharp knife. The highest points of the inside surface are then chamfered away with a sharp knife. This is where the sheet will rest against the side of the Armaflex tube. These two sections will now fit together to complete a T-section. The section of pipe insulation should then be cut along its length for fitting onto the pipe. Armaflex adhesive should be applied to both sides of all joints and then the T-section fitted around the pipe. All joints are pressed firmly together to bond the adhesive. And then additional adhesive is forced beneath the insulation to bond the Armaflex to the circumference of the pipe. Attach the branch section to the pipe and join the two halves of the T. Adhere all seams with Armaflex adhesive. The insulated T will then be fitted with Armacheck silver cladding. There are two methods for this. The first is to fabricate a horizontal and vertical section using two pieces of Armacheck silver sheet. The horizontal section has been cut and a hole has been made for the vertical pipe. The edge of the hole has been feathered to fit around the circumference of the adjoining pipe. Overlaps in the sheet should be secured with rivets and then sealed with Armacheck silver tape. The second sheet of Armacheck silver has been cut to match the curve of the base pipe. When fitted in place, it is secured with rivets along the length of the overlap. The join is finished with Armacheck silver tape. 
Armacheck silver tape is pressure sensitive so should always be applied with a plastic spatula. On vertical pipes, adjoining sections of sheet should be applied so the overlap faces downwards to form a watershed. The second method for applying Armacheck Silver is to use prefabricated T-sections. These are preformed in a wide range of sizes and can be applied directly to the T-section without the need for cutting or fabrication. On vertical sections, the sheet should be applied on top of the T so the overlap faces downwards and creates a watershed. Where there is a reducer causing a stepped pipe section, the cladding can be finished by modifying an end cap. The smallest of the pipe diameters is measured and marked onto the inside of the end cap. Using the marks as a guide, this section can now be removed using cutting shears. And the end cap can be fastened into place. Alternatively, flat end caps are available in two semicircles. Once again, a section is cut from them matching the diameter of the smaller of the two tube sections. The end cap can be fastened in place using Armacheck silver tape and the joints sealed with silver sealant.